Hi everybody, welcome to this absolute mess. Um, in an effort to bring you better, or at least more interesting visually content with more camera angles, I've gone and gotten myself a GoPro Max. So this is a 360 camera. I'm going to mount this to my swing arm out in front of me as a selfie camera, which means I no longer need my selfie camera, one of my four GoPro Hero 8s. So I wanted to put this to use. Uh, I've always seen videos, especially from the bigger channels like Tucker Got, that uh, show him taking off from the ground. And I sit there and think, oh, did he leave the camera there running the whole time? Um, and yeah, I guess you could, but it'd be a lot cooler if you also had it on the ground ready to stop. So I am now demoing the working prototype of a radio-activated proximity shutter trigger for action cameras. So we've got the receiver here set up. I'll show you on the computer. Lots of code, but it is sitting here and listening. And currently the camera would be off. So this servo will be mounted above and I'm gonna do my best to hold it in the right spot. Over here I've got another Arduino with the same radio. I'm gonna go ahead and plug it in. So this will uh, signify me ready to fly turning on the piece that I would be flying with. This will be on the ground. This one will be in the air. I'm just going to go ahead and reset this. I'm going to 3D print all this stuff, but just got to hold it in the right spot. There we go. So you see the camera started recording there. So now we're recording and we're going to go fly away. Now, as it's recording, it's going to be getting packets of information from the transmitter. As soon as it realizes that it either does not have good signal strength or the transmitter is out of range, which I'm going to simulate by unplugging, it's going to go to listening only, and it's going to try that for 20 seconds. I don't know what the camera angle is like there. But uh, basically, if after 20 seconds it doesn't get another signal, it's going to stop the camera because I've flown too far away and it's only for recording my takeoffs and landings. So let's see if I've got this lined up. 10 seconds left. I don't think this is a failure of a demo. It's just me not being able to hold the servo in the right spot long enough. Three, two, one. There you go. Camera stops, and because when it was turned on, it was turned on by hitting the shutter button. When you hit the shutter button again, it turns off. So, save your camera battery, record your takeoffs, uh, and flybys if you have any, and then Later on, when you come back into range, it'll restart before you hit the ground, and it'll record the landing. Hopefully, that's interesting. Yeah, we'll start using that soon. Thanks for watching.